was uh, quick to learn how to fix uh, the iTunes 1600 error. Okay, you push your phone in DFU mode, uh, shift click restore. It seems that everything is going right, everything is going good. And then all of a sudden, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Bam, you hit with that error. So I'm going to show you how to fix this right now. Okay, this is how we're gonna fix the 1600 error. Um, I got it. I'm not jumping my phone. Uh, it's annoying. But anyways, you're going to navigate to my computer. Go to your C drive. From your C drive, you're gonna go to Windows. And then Windows, you're gonna scroll down. Yeah. Really? I'm gonna scroll down to the system thirty two folder and then you wanna click on drivers and then from drivers you wanna go to the ETC from ETC you wanna right click on the host or click on it then right click on it right click on the first file it should be host and I guess just open or if you have that option open with and then you're gonna select the notepad and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna see a whole bunch of gibberish Okay, ignore all the gibberish and go all the way down to where you see uh, some like IP address. Now, if you have a, if you have any, you should have. If you get a 1600 error, you should have a, a address that doesn't have a hashtag in front of it. Just simply put a hashtag in front of it, and then just exit. And uh, of course, you are going to want to save. Alright, from so there, then I'm going to go back in it. iTunes. Shift, left click, and go look for your custom firmware. Load it up, and then everything should go as planned. And so, yeah, like the video, comment, subscribe, ask any questions. Have a good one.